All right, so the last time we were in here, we we're checking out custom maps, and we're back in here checking out, well, custom maps. What else am I going to do in here? If you have any suggestions to what else I could do in this game, by all means, let me know in the comments below, and I'll definitely be sure to do that. If I could do that, assuming that I can. Let's get into it. All right, so the first map we're checking out today is a flood map maze. It could be either treated as a normal maze setup, or you could use it for flooding. Wonder it's a flood. You can set up the whole flood mod. That's what I'm saying. That's all I'm trying to say. Jesus Christ. All of these are at an angle. This one's at the slightest angle possible. I think this one's meant for the highest difficulty. You can see the ones up there all the way in the left corner just skyrocketing into space. Holy crap. I didn't realize how many mazes there actually were, though. There looks like nine mazes on this map. What the hell is that over there? Is that just a random pit of dirt? No, there's a giant maze behind me and I didn't even realize it. It's a big ass maze. Anyway, I kind of love the concept here because mazes have always been a thing since I was a kid. I love mazes and I've always, every time they gave it to us in class when I was in elementary school, I would always just fly through it. A lot of times I would map out the route to the finish before I even drew the line and that, that was just, it was fun. It was a lot of fun. Dead it. Damn it. Shit. Yeah, that's fine. You're not going to hurt the car. Dumb. I mean, it. It's gonna hurt the car, but that's a side. I, I'm not. I, I, it still drives. Okay, how many times am I gonna hit a wall? I need to actually properly use my brakes. Another dead end. What a surprise! Full throttle. Come on, let's go. Seeing the maze from the top view and seeing the maze from inside the actual maze is a little disorienting. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, how far am I into this? How much load? Wow. I'm nowhere near finished. All right, you know what? Moving along to the next map. Well, this one's a lot of fun, and if you want to try it out, I'll leave the name of the map in the link in the description below. Not a link. The name of the map below. Not in the you, know, you get what I'm trying to say. I've only been up for like 30 minutes, so I'm quite tired. We have another map called the Impossible Maze. We're gonna try out. I don't know what the hell is going on with the picture. Well, if those are if those are a bunch of mazes. I guess we're about to find out. Now, right, let's see what the map looks like. Holy crap. I guess it don't really matter which way I go, does it? Let's go to the circle route. Okay, that was a very steep decline. It's a miracle this thing is still intact. This is very colorful, by the way. Shit, which way do I go? I guess I go to the right. It looks like this one. Yeah, this one's just a dead end. All right. I want to at least get through one of these. At least one of these. What the hell is this? Oh shit, okay, I guess we completed the first one. And we've completed the second one in less than five minutes. Okay, you know what, this was a little too easy for... The circles are, at least. There really isn't many places you can go. I suppose it would be more difficult going up the square ones, which... Seemed to go on forever. That one was also fun, I like mazes. I, I don't know why, this is probably gonna be the least interesting video for BMG custom maps ever. I downloaded a bunch of more custom maps, but I can't seem to find them. I don't know where they are. I mean, I got one here, but I tried to open that one. It just looked weird. So we're going to check out the Jungle Rock Island snowy map just because, well, I mean, imagine a jungle island covered in snow. It doesn't sound right, so I'm checking it out. Yeah, right, it already looks weird. I think it's just because nothing, everything has not loaded in yet. Where the hell am I? Wow, this is a white-ass map. It's almost white as my ass. What the hell is with the ocean? Why is the ocean all white? Is it frozen? Can I drive on the ocean? There's only one way to find out. I'm gonna go ahead and drive down there and check it out. Oh god, slidey, slidey. Jesus Christ, you don't have no traction on these. It doesn't even skirt, skirt. It just slides. Okay, are we gonna fall in the water or are we gonna drive over it? We're driving over it. It's freaking nice. How far out can we go before we end up in the ocean? This is wild. <laughs> I really like this. It's actually pretty cool. This is so much fun. You can just casually drift around. Yeah. Whee! I'm spinning. All right, for being honest here, I think the ocean goes on forever like that. I mean, it, it's cool. This is a pretty cool map. The last thing I expected was to have an entire ocean frozen. It's like we're in the Antarctic. Neither ice age happened. It's like a challenge. We're playing carcore. God, come on. Come on, you bastard. The first time you skirt, skirt the entire map. Ah, shit. They actually saved me. Shit, we got a problem. Uh, it's all good. All right, well, I mean, those two custom maps were pretty cool. Why is this water not frozen? How is the entire ocean, which is a constant current, frozen, but this isn't? That's, that's totally realistic. Ah, we're good. Did I expect more from these custom maps? Yes. Did I expect to have more custom maps to check out? Sure, absolutely. Because you know what? I downloaded more custom maps, and all I got were three. Well, four. 
if you want to include the messed up one that doesn't actually have anything in it. But I guess these maps were cool. This one in particular kind of caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting to actually like it as much as I do. With how slidey everything is. Yeah.